What a fine set of Hereford cows with all these. They have a, they're pairing them up now, basically. And they're all their bulls, every bull besides one tic tac toe bull, is all Hudgens. So they're, they're bred for success for sure. Again, these have calves inside. Uh, these are all pairs. So they're pairing them up as we as we speak. So all pairs. Look like all those girls are all five year olds. Uh, this whole pen's five year olds. Yet I see nothing out of the two hundred head I looked at today. I see nothing over five. So throwing it out there. Not old cow in the deal at all. Again, they're they're pulling they're they're pulling the calves, letting them build her up, and they're pairing them. Again, those are all five year olds. I'm gonna jump in the calves. Uh, show you some beautiful babies. The heifers, they bred the heifers, the F1 to, to uh, low birth, they bring these bulls. I like those kids. I like that man. I've done it. One year I had a bunch of heifers I bought in Nebraska. I bred them all to bring his calves look great, just like here, no problems at all. Again, these are the grown cows. Uh, they're, they're, they're breds in their pairs, all with Hudgens babies. More than five year olds. Guys, you'll wear your truck out trying to find a group this good and in this many numbers. Uh, the cross away, those are the are the first kid heifers. And they're a beautiful F1, a beautiful F1, beautiful Rangistar kids, they are. Again, uh, there's some more of these heifers that are bred like that. I, I like this maybe. These little steer calves, when I, was, when I weaned the calves, on, on mine a couple years ago, all the heifers went for replacement money and these black ball these tears you couldn't cross here. Good kids. Again, their moms are all there. They were out there, the heifers. See there? It's their first calf heifers. Not a gate, not a gate, not a Welcome, baby. Good looking calves. And more of the same. I want to video their babies. The pin of babies that just pulled off while I go. Turn them up. Oops. Usually with someone, it, it works better with two people. I'm like a, a gate guy, opens gate. It's what it is. Hey. Going by, going by. Don't smoke me. Don't run me over. All right. All these calves still together. I think it's cool looking that you know, see the quality in these calves. I do have video of the Brahmin bulls they're sired by. Whoop, guys. I cut my teeth in hunger for USA. The great Jim Williams is my neighbor. I, I love some Brahmins. Man, I tell you, this bull here, bull set here. Most of them are Ferguson bulls. Uh, a few Cloverleaf bulls. A couple of little late Steve Hudgens bulls. And a Tic Tac with a toe bull. It's like 30 of them. And they're basically look like age kind of four to six year olds. They're the daddy of all these lovely F1 right for calves. Y'all, people that don't know what these calves do, I know y'all the Angus people don't clue what I'm talking about. But these females, you'll get 14 to 16 years. Again, on normal good grazing, you'll get 14, 16 years, sometimes 20 years of it. They last forever. Like 12 is like a young Brayford. <laughs> Again, I'm talking about on, on good, normal, regular forage, you know. What a set of calves. I mean, you can, I can sell these for you right off the cow, weaned off the cow. I'll get you 1400 ease, 1350, 1400 anyway. A couple years ago, we're getting 1800 right off the cow. So as the market comes back, th this is a hell of a commodity to own. Good set of cattle, guys. Quality's here, call me. What a set of calves. Again, Hudgens bulls typically, and, and Horn Herford, mamas, what a deal. Trio for the breakfast.